My previous past life was not linked to the arts at all. I studied human rights law. I went to England, did my masters in that. <laughs> I did my first play. I was acting in it, and once I got a taste of that, I found it very difficult to go back to law. And that was it. I never looked back. New York, New York. Your vagabond shoes, they are longing to stray. My name is Nida Bhatt. Uh, I am a theatre director, producer and choreographer. Uh, the US Consulate in Karachi nominated my name because they thought I would be a good candidate to go and learn. The first programme that I attended was the Art Presenters programme. So the Art Managers Training Program at the John F. Kennedy Center for Performing Arts uh, is basically a program which is designed to train art managers into establishing a healthy and sustainable arts organization. There are 32 people from 28 countries who are enrolled in this program, me being the only Pakistani. And every art manager has their finger in a different pie. So there are some theatre companies, there are some ballet companies, and it's a, it's a really a wonderful, eclectic mix of people. It's an excellent programme. They try to equip you with tools so that when you go back home, you can run your arts organisation in a healthy and sustainable manner. My first play was The Producers. Um, right after that, however, we did, about a year or two after that, we did Chicago. training program is based on means that you must be a non-for-profit. When you are a non-for-profit, you have a mission. Like our mission at the math school is to encourage and foster the development and growth of the arts industry. This we do through two ways. Number one, by uh, providing arts programs. So things like singing, guitar, dance, where people can come and learn. And the other is uh, for it to serve as a performance venue. Take art seriously. Arts is the lifeline of a society. I think it's it's the heart that beats. It's its soul. Um, so there will always be place for art, no matter how bad things get. It's going to be our light at the end of the tunnel. <laughs>